Fossil locations. Fossils are leftover parts of plants or animals that hardened and were preserved in some cases for millions of years. Fossils are very important for scientists and researchers. By studying these very old samples, they can learn about what life was like on Earth millions of years ago. Fossils have been discovered all across the world. The location where a fossil is found is where that animal or plant lived and died. So, by studying fossil locations, you can imagine what types of animals lived and interacted with each other in the past. Fossil locations are also important because they tell what the planet itself looked like at the time the fossilized animal was alive. For example, if a scientist finds dozens of fossilized shells in a desert, he can assume that at one point the desert had been a body of water. The leftover fossils can act like an old photograph that shows you what a place once looked like. Scientists have also found very similar fossils on continents that are an ocean apart. This has led to the theory that, millions of years ago, all of the continents were connected as one piece of land. This giant continent has been given the name Pangaea. Similar fossils have been found on either side of the lines where scientists believe the continents shifted. The locations of these fossils has proved to be very important. The first fossilized dinosaur bones were found in England. This dinosaur became known as the Megalosaurus. Here, you can see an image of the giant jawbone that was discovered. Soon after this initial discovery, other dinosaur fossils were found throughout North America and Argentina in South America. Some fossil discoveries reveal that the climate in which the fossilized animals lived is similar today. For example, the woolly mammoth is now an extinct animal that scientists know existed thanks to many recovered fossils. All of the mammoth fossils have been found in Siberia, a very cold Arctic climate in Northern Asia. The mammoth fossils tell scientists that Siberia must have had a similar climate even thousands of years ago. How do the mammoth fossils tell this? It is because the fossilized samples reveal that the mammoth was a huge, elephant-like creature covered in thick fur, which protected it from the cold. Look at one last example of a fossil that was not an animal. Did you know that even trees can be fossilized? In fact, there is an entire forest of tree fossils in the United States. The Petrified Forest National Park is located in Arizona and is a whole forest of fossilized trees. Fossils of all kinds have been discovered in this area, making it a favorite of scientists. Fossils of both plants and animals are found in different regions all over the world. The more scientists study these fossils, the more people can learn about Earth and its creatures.